Hang on, is this the... Okay, uh, so I'm supposedly ready, but um, just waiting for the uh, video to actually show up on the stream. So, oh, there we go. Um, so basically, yeah, let's. This is a game that's. Uh, oh, hello. I am I am Greaser or Grease Monkey, depending on what you want to call me. Yeah, okay. So this is a game called Ordnance, and it uh, was made in 2014 by uh, CJA, and these graphics are awesome, shut up. <laughs> like, like top quality IBM graphics, just, it's, um, with some special effects. Well, that, oh, wait, we will see that one special effect, because this is a 100% run. But anyway, um, so I'll count you down, um, I'll give you five seconds to do this, so five, four, Three, two, one, go. And if there's no audio, please start. Alright. So, a little bit of speed tech. That might be faster, but might not. It's easier to. Um, just sort of die straight off. So, this is Ordnance, and as you can probably tell, as you can also probably, some of you may also be able to tell that there's supposed to be an eye there, but there isn't, so don't blame me. <laughs> um, and basically, you got to pick up these uh, four. Um, you've got to pick up these four abilities. Well, you've got to beat these four bosses, which give you all these abilities, and then you need to use them to get to the final boss, but. You only actually need three of them. But this is 100%, and each ability counts as a cipher. 100% means you've got to collect all ciphers. So... Uh, was there 480p in the 80s? There was 480i. Um... Actually, this... This is a character set that was probably made in the 80s, so the graphics are actually probably from the 80s. Oh yeah, that's right, I could, I could have actually typed during, while I was waiting for this. This part's purely random. Okay. Alright, so... We've got to collect all 49 ciphers because uh, 7 times 7 is 49. And uh, the whole entire game, but... I... Oh, I've not missed anything, so, oops. And in, if you're paying very close attention, you'll notice that the game time actually moves 50% faster than real time. So, a, a sub-20 run is actually sort of... Like, if you if you beat this game in under 15 in-game minutes, you've probably beaten it in under 10 real minutes. Which I think I have actually done, but I don't have video evidence for it, so unfortunately this is my best time. Because it's 16-something, officially, so... That's doable. Well, it's doable if you believe me, but, yeah. And then I decide, oh yeah, I'm gonna try and record a run, and then, nah, don't need it. Oh, so this boss fight's great. This boss fight slowly kills itself, and this is the one where you can theoretically softlock. Um, if you have magma, you can recover it. If you have wing... So, the first ability I have is magma ability. And all right, guy decided to cooperate, so that was pretty good, nice. But we're not quite done yet. Oh, oh uh, yeah, and also you can grab things while you're dead, and, and even get to the uh, end of the, the level. Oh, even get to the uh, sorry, you can uh, get the end of the area. Three minutes was that soft lock percent? Alright, so, that's the ice ability, uh... Yeah, I'm just... Oh, oh yeah. I'm just sort of death abuse there. Um... If this were any percent, you could just go that way, and then just... 
grabs the cipher, but it's actually faster. And uh, if I say, if I call them trinkets, please forgive me, because uh, that's what they're called internally. And also, uh, they appear with the letter. Also, um, you'll briefly see them in uh, the letter T. Uh, well, you'll briefly see a like, letter T like that uh, when you die. Ah. Ah! Please. Alright. And this part you can soft lock if you're not careful. Uh, as I did. Fortunately, I didn't. If you drop down too far to the right, you'll get stuck in the wall and uh, you'll have to reset. So, living dangerously by not so. Yeah, so Hank here, uh, when are you going to uh, prove that you have a good time in this game? Um, I, I mean, I, I, uh, it's a good run, but yeah. Oh, actually. Nah, nah, stuff it. I'll wait until I got wing before I grab that. So this is where you get wing. Oh, wait, actually, no, this isn't the part where you touch. This is, this is the, this is the crap boring part. Unfortunately, I also have to... Ah, here we go. This is the fun part. Alright, so now I'm gonna... Oh. That's better. Alright. How are we for Cyphers? We've got all of them, I think. Well, all of them in wing, I think, so that's yeah, just a matter of... I don't do that for speed reasons, I do that because I'm not... Oh, well, I do that because, uh, I'm not perfect at this game. <laughs> uh, this part can... this part can be quite bad. <sighs> oh, there we go. Uh, so, the guy who made this game is... He added in a few sort of false walls so that you can sort of get some of these uh, ciphers fairly early. And if you sort of have a look at the fonts, you'll notice that sort of, um... I got up out of bed the wrong way. Um... Serif. I'm pretty sure this is a serif font. Um... Yes. Oh yeah, this 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 area is great. It's uh, everything's worse with bats and everything's worse with sharks, and this is both. Fortunately, in any percent, you can you don't have to do this area at all. Unfortunately, this isn't any percent. <laughs> Speaking of any percent, uh, I should probably actually upload a video of how it's done. And oh bollocks. I don't understand how that actually managed to work, because that usually results in me dying and having to try it again, but that works. Uh, okay. That area is fine, according to the map in the top right. And... Oops. I just have to be very careful because there's one more cipher that I have to grab from the ice world um, after the after I've been the final boss. I used to cheese this part by um, shooting ice to go to the right, and I might have to do this because my timing's off. Oh, wait, I haven't made it yet. But normally cheese the, I used to cheese that part, and then I found it was actually faster to do it properly instead of waiting for the ice to melt. Oh yeah, fun, fun thing. So those spikes, of course, are supposed to kill you. But if you have wing, what happens is if you, it lets you double jump, but it actually resets your jump if there's anything below you, including a spike. So you can actually just uh, cheese it uh, just by holding jump and just bouncing off these things. It's great.
Unfortunately, you missed miss most of that music, but fortunately, you get to enjoy this music, which is pretty great. You get to enjoy it several times. I normally can shoot this guy down several down earlier. Oh, that decided to play nice. And so that's the final boss. And but I've got one more trinket to grab. Cipher to grab. <sighs> I knew I'd call them trinkets. Uh, shit. Um. Uh, this is this is actually going to be world record. World, sorry, world record with actual evidence. Time. So that's uh, 1503 in game time. It's just just play it. It's, it's actually a great game. Oh, I feel I actually did make sure that I did have enough sides. <laughs> Unfortunately, if I try to bring this other mouse pointer into the equation you don't get to see it. Anyway, so that was Ordnance, and uh, go play it, because it's great. Wait, no, <laughs> wait, this is actually sub t sub t in real time. <laughs> wow. Um, okay, so up next is probably some... Well, up next for me is bed. <laughs> But uh, up next for you guys is an intermission, and uh, probably another thing encouraging you to give money to charity. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. So. So yeah, I'll just see if the unless of course um, someone wants me to do more stuff here, but uh, I'm just seeing if I've <laughs> if it's moved on or not. Um, 